McAvoy lane three got away really well. It's the black cap alongside him. Kyle Chalmers in lane four. And another white cap, Ashton Brinkworth, UWA West Coast, the 19-year-old in lane five. Fantastic start. Really quick off the blocks was Cam McAvoy. Chalmers is with him. Doesn't always do it from the front, but he's in front here. He's going to lead at the turn. Look, he'll be leading at the turn. That's a new thing for him to be doing. We're used to seeing him slightly behind as he goes through. He's got a very strong backhand, and we know he's been doing a lot of work around the 200 looks but slightly choppy i have to say uh in in the stroke and he'd be looking at that but wow this is going to be a fast swim he got a brilliant turn and he's out now by nearly three quarters of a body length kicking really hard chalmers is going to go back to back defends his title 47 4 8 brilliant swim from kyle that's, chalmers that's faster than what he did in rio that is his best performance under 47 5. полуфинал. Напомню, что вчера в эстафете самое высокое время, самое быстрое время по-моему 47 с копеечками как раз показал именно Влад Гринев. Напомню, что Владислав был четвертым на последнем чемпионате Европы в Глазго на 100 метровке вольном в личном номере. Напомню, что Влад Гринев и по-моему Данила Изотов вышибли из финала не кого-нибудь, а Володю Морозова, который сначала не очень воспринимал так... Ну, мол, да, российская сборная, я же лидер. А когда он оказался третьим запасным, вот здесь как-то все по-другому сразу стало. Но еще раз повторюсь, Влад Гринев тогда был очень хороший четвертый результат на чемпионате Европы. Напомню, что у нас рекорд страны придет Андрею Гречину, 47-57, причем я видел Андрея здесь на трибунах. 47-43, успел сказать, новый рекорд страны. Был установлен только что на дистанции 100 метров от выходящей. Но вот сейчас Влад Гринев... Вновь переписывает эту строчку и теперь 47... Medley relay. Yes, we're not, we're not going to do a three-man relay. <laughs> we're going to have somebody to back it up. So, Yasuki Ledyard and Wickham in one. Callum Jarvis, Bath two. Jack Thorpe, Edinburgh three. University of Stirling and Duncan Scott in four. Stirling also with Scott McClay in five. David Cumberledge, Edinburgh. It's a very much a Scottish race, this, isn't it? In six, seven. Another Scotsman, Craig McLean and Tim Shuttleworth of Loughborough in lane number eight. What kind of split time are we going to get from Duncan Scott here? The answer is 23-0-1-0. And Scott McClay in second, 23-5-0. Cumberledge in third. He takes half a body length out of the rest of the field just on that underwater. Absolutely incredible. This is where this morning he started to ease off, but he's going to give it absolutely all. We'll see in that last five metres where he turns to that windmill stroke to, to get a good finish. There 48 is what we need. 48 is what he needs. Is he going to get that 48? He certainly is. A 47.87 for Duncan Scott. That is a new British record as well. The first of the week from Duncan Scott from the University of Stirling. Scott McClay is teammate in second place, 49.05, and David Cumberledge with a 49.11. So not as he got the time, but he's broken his own record as well with a 47.87. This event is moving on. Thank you.